All right, this little Thunderhawk has been phenomenal for me this year. I don't know how it's gonna look. Oh, what? Ah! Woo, you know he did. What is up everybody? Welcome back to Shell Outdoors. Today's video was kind of impromptu. In fact, I've already filmed it. I'm just making this intro because I didn't really know what I was gonna do today. I knew I only had about an hour to fish. I knew I wanted to do some ponds because the video I did this month on the Monster Bass channel, I talked about how to get permission on private ponds. Well, I didn't go to private ponds today. I actually went to public ponds, any pond that I could find that did not have a no trespassing sign. So I ended up going to two ponds. I had one hour and after catching a couple of fish on random stuff, I was like, dude, this should just be a slam. And if you're new to pond hopping or to fishing, a slam is where you get a monthly subscription box and you go out and try to catch a fish on every single lure in that box. Or in my case, I was using monster bass. I had my April bag with me. I had it in my little pond hopping backpack. So I was like, you know what? Let's try to do a slam on my monster bass April bag. Cause Monster Bass sends out a bag now that you can reuse year after year. In fact, if you haven't checked out Monster Bass, go over to their website and check it out. Make sure you follow them on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, all that stuff. So, as we go through this video, I want you to comment below any mistakes you see me make or anything that you would have done or anything that you like that I did so that way I can get better and that we can share experiences together. I always share my experiences with you guys, so always feel free to give advice to me or to share your opinion of what I should or shouldn't have done. So let me know how you guys like this. Let's get into it. Tip number one, never park where it says no parking. See how it ends? See where I parked. Ta-da. I haven't fished in a couple of days. I worked around the house. I did a ton of stuff this week. I need to reward myself. And there's no, no fishing signs. <laughs> oh, look at this big drain. Ooh, I'm starting off right here, son. What do I got on? How about the X Zone lures? It's a little bit bright to have this bright red glitter, but I'm okay with it. Texas rig. I'm going to start right above this drain. Let's launch it out there. I'm gonna purposefully come down this shoreline because this water looks pretty muddy. And these fish should be up in the shallows. Although this is shaded on this side, so maybe I need to hit the sunny side. I probably should have. Ooh, big hit. There he is. Got him. Got him. Oh, oh, I didn't got him. Oh, come on. Oh, I didn't have him. Gosh darn, dude. That's disappointing. All right, back in the water we go. All right, already 0 and 1. All right, this little Thunderhawk has been phenomenal for me this year. I don't know how it's gonna look. Oh, what? What? First cast, little sucker. First cast as soon as it hit the water? Okay. All right, okay, little guys. I need to make a fish tank, tank one, take one home like this. All right. All right, one fish. Oh man, you guys are gonna freak out when you see this little pond. And there is no, no trespassing signs. It says no boating, no skating, no swimming. Look at this. This looks like a dream. My gosh. Oh my goodness. We're gonna go around this little corner. Plus I saw some shallows that I feel like might be juicy. I mean, it should be the spawn around here by now. 
like for real. Oh man. Oh my. I don't know if this is shallow, but it looks good enough for me. like a ton of bricks oh my goodness and it came off easy bro easy bro easy bro oh my goodness bro he gonna get back to the water did he not even get the hook again okay i don't know what i'm doing wrong to not get these hook sets but he's very skinny but he hit on the egg zones texas rigged he has a couple of hook marks in his mouth, so he's been caught. Very, very skinny, but you know, that's okay. Thanks for coming out to play, bro. You have a lot of energy. See ya. Wow. All right, windswept side, sunny day. Shiny lure right here should do the trick. Shiny lure off rocks on the windswept side on a sunny day. Let's go, let's go. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. One barely missed it. He bit, he missed it right here at the edge of the water. Come on, let's go for a... Dude, so I've caught... One, two... I've caught two fish now on two lures. Let's go for a slam. There's one. Do I got him? It's little. Oh my gosh, is it little. Oh my goodness. Yep. Tiniest fish in the lake. That counts, bro. That counts towards the slam right there. That is a largemouth bass on the catch outdoors. It's check slap. Could have used him as bait. Hey, that counts, baby. But I'll go for a bigger one. goodness did he bite again is this the same fish bro what are you doing i don't think it's the same fish i must just be into a mess of little guys down here is this the king of little oh my goodness oh my goodness three in a row Tell you what I am though, I'm getting hungry boys. Oh, oh, big fish. Oh, good fish, good fish. Oh, stay down, stay down. Oh, now that's what I'm talking about. A little bit better. All right, buddy. Thank you for playing the game. Goodbye. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. I got tangled up some, some string. Where'd that go? Look at this. Some jackwad. If you have a tangle like this out on a shoreline, pick it up. Are you kidding me? All right, I'm gonna take this lunker hunt off, even though I think it would catch fish here. Just for the purpose of the video, I am gonna take it off. And uh, I got a little something to put on. We'll see what we can do. 
There you are. Oh, I see you. I'm going to tie on this Bait Lab Fry Shad Flamin' Shiner. Now, we do not have golden shiners around here. I don't think we have gold shad or anything like that. But we're going to see. If I can catch one on this Bait Lab and one on that Chase Baits, we have a really good chance at a, uh, at a, you know, what's it called? <laughs> What are those things called? Uh, a slam. Ooh, this thing has like silver glitter on top. That's going to be great for this sun. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. In the middle of the fountain water, get on the shore. Ba-boom, ba-da-boom, ba-da-bing. On the bait lab. Ah! Come here. We're being difficult to work with. Let's get him out of here. Look at that. On the bait labs, golden shiner. We don't even have golden shiners around here. Goodbye, friend. Thank you for letting me catch you. You may swim away. Goodbye. Boom! Uh, literally, when I set the hook, it was under the water fountain. All right, all right, all right. How much time do I got? Dude, I only have... I was supposed to be leaving in two minutes. I'm going to give it seven. Deer 13 fishing. My envy is really messed up, and I need a new drop shot rod. Please call me. Oh, no way. Oh, while I was messing with it, I had a hit. No way. All right, I'm going to extend my deadline seven minutes. Seven minutes, y'all. And then I got to go. Always wear your seat belts, boys and girls. Always. I'm trying to find my way out of this neighborhood right now, so I'm only doing like seven miles an hour, but I did not get the slam done. I'm sorry. I think I caught seven or eight fish in one hour on four lures. Um, not too bad, not too bad. The only thing I tried that I did not catch a fish on was the Lunker Hunt, which was not out of this month's box. And then also the uh, out of this month's box, I didn't get one today on the Chase Baits I think it's called the split tail or fork tail. However, I caught a fish on that the other day. But the egg zones got one out of two, lost one in the water. And then uh, the jack slap from Catch Outdoors pulled in, what, three fingerlings, like pinky sized ones, and then one good one. And then the bait labs, right? The bait labs. And then I feel like there was something else. Did I name them all off already? Oh, the Thunderhawk swim bait. First fish I caught. All right, that's it. It's about to get real windy because I'm about to get on a big road. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you so much for being here. Drop a comment below if you like any of them baits. And let me know how you're doing this season fishing. All right, I got to go home. I got to go to work. I got to get some turkey hunting gear ready to go. Peace.